All right, now we are back, and have we figured out? Oh, uh, okay, yeah. I knew there was there was a torch I missed shooting at. It was like right down at the very bottom. Let's see, is that something we can push? No. Okay. Well. Okay. Well, we'll come back to that. So we got a lock door there. All right. Uh, there's nothing else to shoot at. Better check outside. Oh wow! More spotlights. Oops. That kind of caught us off guard. This is where distracting comes in handy. Or at least it usually does. A hundred gems. And another key. Nice. Okay. If we can sneak past... Just in case, I'll divide my links up, but there we go. Nice. Alright. Let's see what's in here. Oh, a lantern! Okay. Yeah, I guess since we got some some unlit torches, it figures we'd have to have a lamp. Let's see. Oh, there's actually four of them. Let's see, not... See, not one of them will do it at once. Let's see if we can try to divide them up. I think we're gonna have to. I think we're gonna have to try a certain formation. I don't know why I thought that'd work. You can't control them all at once unless you do a full formation. Eventually, I got the idea. There we go. Okay, cool. Moving along. Okay, good. We're full on hearts. We're all set. We got as many gems as we could. And let's see. And everything went quiet. Everything went quiet. That is that that that's not really comforting. You know when everything goes quiet, something's about to happen. Now well, let's see. Let's light all the torches in here and find out. Oh God, no! Not you again! I killed you once before already! Or wait, did I? Well, either way, okay. I killed you before, I can do it again. <laughs> Well, pretty much about like the last the last time in, in the previous stage. Light all the torches, and then strike them dead. He, he ate me! Oh, there's the little prick. He's the one that escaped last time. Well, he's apparently the real target that you gotta strike. Eventually, he'll spit you back out. And then he'll blow all the torches out. And send his crony pose at you. Damn it, quit pushing me in the damn spikes. Oh, another thing you don't want to do, you don't want to get spotted in his lantern because he blows like crazy and tries to, tries to uh, pin you to the wall or spike if he's lucky. Come here, you. Let's get a few more hits on this little brick. Ah! You didn't get me this time. <laughs> Come on. Give me that heart! Give me the heart! No! Well, that doesn't matter anyway. I think he's about that. A couple more so I can catch him. And there he goes. With that, the rest of him goes. 
Finally. I think he's dead now. And boy, was that ghost loaded. <laughs> and just enough to power up our four sword. Sweet! Alright. Glad that's over with. Just as the owl suspected, there was another maiden. Well, let's see who it is. Link, thank you. You carry my hopes with you, as well as all of Hyrule's. Wait. Is that the blue royal jewel you carry? How did you come by it? Is that so? The Knights of Hyrule. So even the jewels are now. Link, all we can do is put our faith in the light and press on. Overcoming each obstacle that confronts us. My forest has lost its light. Darkness covers it like a shroud. Link, will you go to the forest? Perhaps you will find some clues there. In the heart of the forest is a temple. The dark mirror can be found there. Long ago, a dark tribe invaded Hyrule. They were defeated and imprisoned within the mirror. The tribe's mirror prison was then secreted away and hidden in the forest temple. to sever its connection to this world. That dark mirror must never fall into the hands of those with evil hearts. Link, the mirror is a danger in anyone's hands but yours. No one else can be trusted. Retrieve the dark mirror from the palace and keep it until Princess Zelda is safe. Please, you are the only one we can depend on. First, let us proceed to the forest. <laughs> 